so what, what can you kind of tell me about the history of Get On Down? So for people that are familiar with the, how, how did it all come together? What was the inspiration? Um, well, the inspiration was, you know, I think as time goes on, like physical media becomes a little less uh, valuable to some people. You yep. know, with artists, you know, with music today, it's, you know, obviously the iTunes, everything else going on, you're not, you know, you don't always need to buy a CD, whereas for a while that was the only, your only option. You know, with Get On Down, one thing is, you know, part of it is wanting to expose music that we believe in, no matter, you know, if it's a Muddy Waters record or, uh, you know, Tom Scott to The Far Side to Nas, like, you know, we want to celebrate them in, you know, kind of in a way they deserve, so to speak, mm. you know, uh, like a mantelpiece or done properly. So there's one aspect of wanting to expose people to it. Right. And then there's the other aspect of, you know, there's a lot of people are already fans of these artists, but, you know, it's just giving them a little something more and a little something different. Uh, this one right here is probably one of my top favorites, it's the Far Side uh, Music Box. We did this for uh, Record Store Day last year, okay. 2012. Um, it speaks for itself, I'll just open it up for you. On the way up, anyway. Okay, so this is like a set of um, all the far side singles on, on the 7 inch. Oh, yeah, nice colored vinyl. Yeah. Crazy. Yeah. There's a little too much volume there, and then, you know, the CD and the puzzle. I, I, you know, I, I think as time goes on, the, you know, with everything we've been doing and wanting to do down the road, we want to get, you know, the artists involved, the engineers, producers, you know, people... Yeah, need, to tell the story. Yeah, because like I said, like, the, you know, the people buying these are the hardcore fans, you know, and some maybe not, but they just think mm. it's a cool package. Or they just weren't around when, this, yeah, yeah, when it yeah, came yeah, out, but, so it's, yeah. It's just, you know, it's like connect, you know, bringing a little more connection to it with people like, you know, who, like you said, Black Rock and Run, like some people... You know, even hip hop heads might not even know the record. It's, yeah, it's yeah. a fantastic record. So I think, you know, any more any extra information you can have about it, it's it's kind of, you know, it plays into the whole like trying to teach people about you know records we're into and giving them as much information as as we can in the time we're doing. Obviously, with some people like you know some artists are busy, it just doesn't work out with timing. Sure. You know, I think with Nas, we wanted to get him you know involved at the time. Or, it just you know, it just, just couldn't happen. It, yeah. It just didn't work out because he was just coming off of uh, you know his life is good record. And so yeah. his schedule was crazy, and that yeah. was a huge record for him that year. do grow they just don't grow sometimes in the time that we need them to because you know we're under schedule too we need to get our releases out and uh, you know it just doesn't work out always but you know when it does it, it, it's it, it's I think it, it, it brings a project to a whole other level Which, which projects have, have you been able to have the most involvement with the artists um, off the top of your head? I think the upcoming uh, nonfiction. Oh, okay. Very hands-on. Oh, yeah, They're I can imagine. Well, because they have, they've been there for their whole career, I guess. They've, yeah, yeah, they've yeah, been but, very know, nice. but this is also something where we're, going, we're working directly with them on mm -hmm. it and not going through a label who has their own weird agenda. This is going to the artist who's, you know... Oh, because they own the rights there, because right? they did it through yeah. Uncle Harry and all that stuff, didn't yeah, they? Yeah, so. So, so it's like, you know... So the, I mean, and, and the, you know, which is good. I, it's, 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 you know, I think with any of these, it would be great to be like, you know, send that to Nas. What do you think? What would you change? What do you want to do? Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? And then we have some, we do have some stuff coming up later this year that we've worked with people directly on, but we haven't been announced yet. Uncut, baby. What?